Hi guys, welcome to this session. In today's session, we're going to talk about different types of LinkedIn audience targeting, which we can do in the account. So let's begin with this. So the first type of targeting, which you can do in LinkedIn ads is going to be location targeting. So in location targeting, you are able to target your users based on their geographical location, uh, which they have provided on their profile or through the IP address tracking, which LinkedIn ads does. So here you are able to target based on, you can target based on regions like the country, state, city, pin code targeting, all of that will be possible under this particular option. So that becomes our location targeting, which we can do in LinkedIn ads. Similarly, you also have audience attributes. Audience attributes is basically a type of targeting in which you're able to target certain audiences uh, based on their company, the members, company, job experience, education, demographics, interest, and traits. So here you will get a lot of subcategories provided and you can select the categories which are most relevant for your business. For example, under company category, you will get subcategories like company category, company connections, followers, company growth rate. Similarly, when we come to demographics, you can target based on members age, gender, education. So in education, you have options to target based on degrees, okay, fields of study, members, schools, the schools they belong to. Similarly, when you come to job targeting, job experience, you can target based on job functions, job seniority, title, member skills, years of experience. And then you come to interest and traits where we can target LinkedIn members based on their interest, their member groups and member traits. So these are all the options you will get under audience targeting, which we can do in LinkedIn ads. Going forward, another type of targeting which you can do here is matched audiences. Now in matched audiences, what we do is we are able to create a custom audience as per our requirement. And this can be of three types. The first is where we upload a company or contact list. This can be a list of all the users who we have, who have opened an account with our business and we're able to target them through their email addresses. Also, we can do under matched audiences is retargeting, which is basically a case wherein when a user comes to our website or they engage with our ads, or let's say they view our video ads, they open or submit our lead forms. In such a situation, you can follow these users with your LinkedIn ads. So that also is an option. And the third one, which you get to use over here is third party audiences and lookalike audiences also, which you can do under matched audiences. So lookalike audiences are going to be a feature wherein we are able to target audiences who are similar to our matched audience segment. So LinkedIn tries to find more users who will have similar traits like the ones which we found in the matched audiences. So with the help of this, we are trying to increase our reach to reach out to more users similar or relevant to our business. In the same manner, we also have an option to use third party audiences. In third party audiences, our campaign manager can be linked to an or a marketing partner to create a third party audience segment. So here you will be able to select from the third party audiences uh, in this and you can integrate your audience with the marketing partner. And now what can happen is the data you select from the partner program uh, pro platform will be matched with the LinkedIn members to create an audience segment. Now this can, the size of this audience segment can be dependent on the marketing partner and it can take up to a week for your audience to fully process and be ready to be used in a campaign. So that can be, another type of audiences, which we can use here in LinkedIn ads. So these are all the types of LinkedIn audiences, guys, which we will get as an option to choose while we are creating the campaigns. I hope this makes sense. And now you understand how these audiences work. Thank you so much, guys, for listening into this session today. Have a great day, guys.